Uh, it'd be nice if they had actually built these fucking walls. They don't seem to be building these fucking walls, uh, nor these ones. Uh, guys, you fucking planning on building any walls uh, anytime soon? No? Uh, I wanted to build a fence here too. I want to build a fence like this, uh, because I also want to have a, a metal detector here. Where's the, where's the metal detector? I want to have a metal detector here. Uh, and I want to have metal detectors here as well. And uh, also, for good measure, I would like metal detectors there. Uh, and that should be fine. Uh, I think uh, this is like kind of a wide... Uh, th we're going to need like three metal detectors here. It's a little bit expensive, but it's worth it. We don't want anyone horsing around in cell block B. Especially medium security. I mean, you can never be too careful. Holy shit. Alright, we'll hook up those med metal detectors once they're placed. We'll hook them up with some power. Uh, and then make sure that nobody's fucking around inside uh, cell block B. Oh, look, that one's already hooked up. That one will be hooked up too. And it looks like these ones too. Look, these ones are being built right on the power lines. Fantastic. Excellent. Oh, and I think these ones will benefit from the power too. We might not even need to run any new wire. Holy shit. That annoys me. <laughs> you can't, I cannot get rid of that hole. I'm, I'm very angry about that. Uh, we'll get rid of this planning. Is there any other planning uh, obstructing it? No. Okay. Perfect. Great. Everything is going very well. We have a whole bunch of delivery trucks uh, outside because look at all these lights. Have we actually installed all these lights? I think we have actually. As soon as these walls go up. Oh, you know what? They aren't building the walls because look at this. All these fucking lights. We're going to have to dump all these lights so that these stupid... Um, we need a bigger delivery area. Holy shit. I mean, actually, it might be worth just having a new delivery area up here. That's causing a lot of problems. Look, we'll have a, another delivery area up here. Just for now. Just temporarily so that we can start getting some of this stuff in so that we can finish some of these jobs. I didn't realize that there was like about 20 fucking trucks lined up outside the detention center X filled with lights and bricks and all the other kind of shit that we need. That's, that's kind of annoying. Uh, let's check programs again. How are we doing? Oh, it looks like workshop safety and... It, and sorry... It's just workshop safety induction, not end induction, which I was trying to say uh, and then getting confused because I didn't see the end there. Uh, it looks like this is like half done for the 10 to 12 class and the 5 to 7 class. There's two people on each. That's going to be pretty good. We'll actually be able to start with getting some of these license plates manufactured, hopefully. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, and it looks like we still have three people that have passed the kitchen safety and hygiene class. There's currently three people uh, on it right now, and that's about half done as well. Uh, we need to think about getting a classroom built. Uh, we could probably get a classroom built like around here somewhere. Although this is sort of like the staff area out here. We probably want to keep it that way too. Look, we've got all this extra room. We can maybe make like a new power room up here or something. Uh, some more offices. Uh, we can have like a security area and stuff like that. So maybe the classroom we can actually put... Holy fuck. What? I mean, we're running out of space. I don't know where the hell we're going to put a classroom. It's got a really big yard here. I mean, maybe we can put the classroom in here somewhere or something. We have to think about it. Um, it may be that we just um, sort of uh, remove some of our min sec cells. Make a big classroom here that can be used by both medium and min sec. Uh, and then just have a smaller contingent of min sec prisoners. Or, you know, we could just expand down here uh, eventually and build some more shit down here, including a classroom or something. Who knows? We'll have to see. Uh, for now, though, let us get uh, a holding cell set up in here like this. Uh, we need to have uh, some objects in here as well for this holding cell, uh, including a bench. We need a bench. We need a bench. Yes, we're going to have a bench on either side like this. There we go. Two benches and uh, for each side as well, a toilet. Look at that. So when you're sitting, that can be like the queue. Look, they can all be sitting down on the bench in the line uh, and then when one guy is done taking his dump the other guy just sort of scoots his butt over onto the toilet and takes his dump it'll be like a like a factory it'd be like an assembly line of guys in a holding cell taking a dump holy shit i didn't think it was possible but actually i'm quite excited about that that makes me very excited all right let's run some pipes down into here then uh to hook up these toilets uh, and then once the holding cell is uh ready uh, we're in much better position than to accept uh, medium security guys. Uh, we also want a yard. Do we want a yard? Yeah, we want another yard. Where's the yard? Yards right here. Perfect. This is going to be quite the yard. This is 
gonna be a nice big yard for these minimum security or sorry medium security guys they'll have like all these places to play hide and seek in and stuff i'm sure they're really gonna enjoy the hell out of it uh let's lay some turf down here too look we'll get some grass down in here we're gonna make this yard real nice nice area some nice shady spots uh for these medium security guys to uh lay down and read a book in the summer sun I think they I think they deserve it. I think they they totally deserve it. I think that that's something that they will benefit from greatly actually. Uh, but we'll have to see. It remains to be seen. Maybe they won't benefit from it and uh, actually maybe they'll go crazy and kill each other out on the grass and then stain the grass with uh, each other's blood and stuff. You never know. It's medium security. I mean, I'm just saying. I know it sounds pretty brutal, but you you can never take your eyes off these guys because God knows what they're going to get up to. It's fucking crazy. Holy shit, look at this. But, I mean, the thing is now... Alright. The the delivery room uh, is 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 going. <laughs> we're taking it. We're taking it away. Look at... Get out of here, deliveries. Look, now all of a sudden the whole procession of trucks is moving. And that's because uh, this is actually deliveries. Is storage full? Storage might be full. We're, we're going to have to see. We have all of these fucking lights here. Uh, oh, look at here we here they come! Look, it's an entire army of construction workers coming to unload these trucks so that we can finally actually build some of this shit. Look, they're gonna take the trash out. Uh, can we actually change this door so that staff can open it? No door normal mo mode. Select. So, uh, I don't think I can change that. I don't think I can actually change this door. Door mode locked open, locked shut, or uh, normal. Okay. All right, I can't change that door. Well, we're gonna have to wait for a guard. Maybe we should have a guard on patrol out there. Yeah, I think that's gonna be. We're gonna have. Oh, there is one already. We're gonna make a new patrol route, uh, which is just like by the door here. We'll, we'll have a guard pacing around back and forth here, and uh, we'll also have one here. There's nobody on that route for some reason. Okay, that's a bit better. Oh wow, look at that. It took them no time to actually put all of that cool grass down in the yard. It looks quite nice actually. Uh, let's also get some paving stones. Look, we'll make like this like path sort of thing here. Look, we're gonna make a path that leads to here too. Like this. And then we'll also have some paths come out into here like this and like that. Perfect. Holy shit. Man, cell block B is the place to be if you're ever in uh, New York City. No? I almost rhymed. Well, it sort of did rhyme. But no, honestly, Cell Block B, look at it. It's it's majestic. It just looks absolutely fantastic. We have a canteen here now, too. Look, we can get this canteen up and started. Uh, we can also get this kitchen up and running, too. Get lots of stuff to do inside the kitchen. Uh, we can have a staff door here as well, so that uh, we can make sure that the kitchen staff get into the kitchen and do their shit. What the hell? Hey. Hey, what's what's going on? Who who escaped and how? Okay, we're gonna have to do a, a cell search. Who is that? Who who is it? Are they gone? Is it, there's no dummy there. Okay, we found the hole, but uh, we can't find. Is it just the start of a hole? Is it you? Was it was it him? Yeah, it possibly found tools on Chris Trudell, the 58 year old man. Holy shit. That was a close one. My god, we almost lost another prisoner. Thankfully, we didn't lose another prisoner. Uh, wow, we've actually got capacity for one more prisoner once this, uh, once this hole is filled in by a construction worker who's actually coming to it right now. Great. Filling in the hole, fixing the toilet. Uh, oh. No, there's still, there's still some tunnel. We need to find uh, the rest of the tunnel. Can we actually... We can't search the infirmary. I think it goes into the infirmary. God damn it. We're going to have to find the rest of this tunnel. Don't make me do it, everybody. Don't make me do a shakedown. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to do it. All right, fine. It's a fucking shakedown. <laughs> we're doing a shakedown. Look at this. We found a tunnel in a cell, and we're doing it... We're doing a shakedown. Look, we're finding all sorts of stuff. We've already found three hammers, a syringe... An electric drill. I don't know what you were hoping to achieve with an electric drill. I mean, there's nowhere to even plug that thing in in any of the cells. God damn it. Fifteen spoons. We found a bottle of poison. Or maybe that's just some, some cleaning product or something. And one fork. Uh, we've searched so far nearly 30 out of 83 places in this shakedown. Holy shit, this is kind of cool. I've never done a shakedown before. 
What did I do last time? I did a search of all cells. Okay. We're going to find this fucking tunnel system. And we're going to see who actually escaped. Have we had an incident? We have one person awaiting solitary confinement, apparently. Let's check our finances and see. That's a good way of checking. Days without incident. That's been 3.9 days. So nobody's actually escaped. We just found the start of a tunnel and we're not able to find the rest of it somehow. Look at this. It's like totally fucking broken. Where's the, where's the rest of the tunnel? Oh, is it under the bed? Oh, I see it. Oh, shit. Okay. I couldn't see that. It was very... Uh, look at this. We're going to remove tunnels. It's right here. So whoever that was, I think it was that guy that's in solitary, was trying to dig his way out, and he'd actually dug a tunnel into this next cell and was being really spooky with the prisoner who's in the, um, the cell adjacent to him. Uh, so maybe the shakedown wasn't necessary, but actually... I'm saying that. I mean, as soon as somebody d does try to actually escape, um, I think a shakedown is in order. Look at that. We're almost done. We're almost at 83 places. Uh, in the meantime, let's get some stuff set up <laughs> in the kitchen and the canteen. And these cells, too. Holy shit. Okay, these are almost ready now. We're almost ready to accept prisoners into um, our medium security block. It's only taken, like, the best part of an hour. But there you go. <laughs> it's slow progress, but hey, at least it is kind of progress. All right. Shakedown complete. Uh, there was like some sort of like train horn uh, that went off uh, to signify the end of uh, that, uh, the, the shakedown. That was probably worth doing. I think we found a lot of tools. We confiscated a lot of stuff. Uh, I think there's a grant actually where you probably need to use the shakedown uh, thing to uh, to gather up all the shit that people have been collecting. Try to find like drugs and tools and stuff like that and you get like a bit of a, a cash money reward for it. That's pretty cool. Okay, we now have uh, two cells either side uh, for this uh, new cell block so we can actually start cloning those. That'll be great. Look, we're just going to clone the whole thing. We'll clone the whole thing and make sure that we place it all in the right place uh, like so. Look at this. Look at this got everything it's got fucking everything all the way down it's costing us a little bit of money uh, we're still fairly rich though so it's fine and there we go so with the cloning tool we have managed to build everything that we need to build for each of those cells uh, and we can copy the same up here too look at that it even makes the room into a cell as long as you uh, line it up properly and don't end up fucking screwing it up and placing like bricks and shit in all the wrong spots. Uh, which I don't seem to be doing, surprisingly. I bet you're just as surprised as I am. Look at that. Look at all the expenditures. Totally worth it though. We now have uh, capacity for what, well, soon to be uh, an extra 24 medium security prisoners. Uh, which to me is just utterly fantastic. Uh, we also want to have another common room. We're going to have a different common room this time though. This common room is going to come out like this. And we're going to have a shower room here too. It's an open shower room for this block only. Uh, which will come out to here. Uh, let's also get some uh, drains. Look, we're going to get some drains. So that the shower room doesn't leak out uh, into the hallway. Because that would be gross. Get all damp and everybody would get like some sort of like breathing problems and stuff from all the dampness. And that's not something that we want. Set up a whole bunch of shower heads. Perfecto. Uh, let's also get some pipes. Small pipes. Uh, which should be no problem to install. These guys should be able to actually access that area. Without having to worry about these jail doors. Uh, which are in all the cells. Oh, look at they're all having a bit of trouble with getting into these places. Look, all the guards have to now start um, running over, letting them in. Uh, let's get a, a guard patrol route set up. So we're going to have two here. Look, we're going to have one that comes down like to here, like that. Perfect. And then we'll have another slightly bigger one that sort of comes down all the way here and patrols uh, part two of cell block. Three. Excellent. We're going to need to hire more guards. Luckily, we have a lot of money. Look at that. We could do with another, like, four guards, I think. Should we get four more guards? Uh, they cost 100 per day and 500 to play. Yeah, that's worth it. Let's get four more. Look at that. Four more guards added into uh, Minsec land, uh, the Rainbow Pony land of Detention Center X. Uh, they're out in the yard, and they're already gone. Great. Okay. So these guys are on their patrols now. They should be able to help with opening up some of the jail doors and stuff like that when these construction workers need to get in. Uh, we've got this common room, uh, which we can set up a, I don't know, 
like a, a pool table. Should we get a pool table in here? Get a pool table in here. Let's also get a TV in there for them too. Where's the fucking TV? Come on, TV. Reveal yourself. I can't see it anywhere. Where the fuck is the TV? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, we'll have a TV facing uh, this way. Is that right? That looks right. I think that's the box at the back, isn't it? Must be. Yeah, it must be. 